Hi guys, Hillary here for Waterlogged on behalf of saltwateraquarium.com. I am in Denver, Colorado for Reef Stock Denver. I know the show has a bunch of amazing corals. I attended last year for the first time, but I also know that there are some new products that we are gonna get to show you. So let's go ahead and check things out. fried corals and uh, the basic procedures and I just want to talk about uh, Jake's corals here and some of the corals that uh, meant a lot to Jake that he personally collected we got the uh, Jake's Ramosa which was uh, is a Palau Astria Ramosa that uh, Russell Kelly and uh, him collected in the Solomon Islands the majority of it when you look at it it's either brown or silver we're doing a frag of this particular coral we always look at the best possible way to get the most attractive piece. booth where Jay is going to tell us a little bit about the new product. So this is the Shark Pro. The Shark Pro 500, we have a Shark Pro 700, 
and a Shark Pro 900. But why does it matter to the saltwater enthusiast? Well, imagine putting this in your sump, maybe using the Venturi to get a little bit of oxygen. You could put carbon in here, GFO. You can use a sponge. And you're trapping all the detritus from the sump, which is the idea, right? So everybody wants to move water to kick it up, but at some point you gotta clean it anyway. So why not kick it up and then trap it? and then clean it by removing it. And also, getting some flow in there. So what is that, three in one? It's pretty cool. Very nice. The neat part is, I could pull it off, do all of my cleaning, put it right back, and I'm still getting the flow when this leaves. No more suction cups, all magnets. Wow. So that's an even cooler set of that, where this sits inside the sump, on the outside. Now you're moving around that detritus and cleaning up that sump without the issues of suction cups. But how do I take the head off to clean it? Well, this is a system that stays in place and you remove this. All of that and a five-year warranty. That's the CJ Shark Pro. All right, well, thank you so much. <laughs>I am here at the PNW Custom. They have all of these little nano tanks that are adorable. How's it going today? We are having an absolute blast. We have our micro tanks on display and we have some new ones as well to show you. So we're gonna talk about our new system, which is our 2.5 gallon mini lagoon. So this here is our new 2.5 gallon mini lagoon. It is a combination of our lagoon and our small in one tank. It uses the same features that you find in our small in one tank, such as the light, the pump, the media basket, but we've also created a really customizable stand with multiple different options that you'll be able to do for things like glasses holders, uh, for coral viewing glasses, for filters, and more. All right, folks, so we are here at the Marine Pure booth, and I am going to leave it to the pros to tell us a little bit about their line and one of their new products. How's it going today? Hi. Oh, very good. Uh, thank you very much for asking. Um, my name is Paul. I'm with Sir Media. Uh, we make Marine Pure Biofilter Media. It's a very, very high surface area and open porosity biofilter media. So the whole part is available for beneficial bacteria growth, just much more efficient than most products out on the market. Uh, just highlight new products that we have uh, at the show this, this year is the Marine Pure Vault. The vault is uh, just a place to store your media, uh, keep it nice and neat within the sump. Uh, it does fit one Marine Pure block or a gallon of Marine Pure spheres or what else, whatever else you might want uh, to keep safe and easy to move around in your sump. And one other new product we have about a year and a half ago are the Marine Pure Pods. It kind of bridges the gap between a larger Marine Pure block and Marine Pure spheres. Uh, we do have a three pack of them for nano tanks and also larger packs for large uh, systems. Thank you so much. We appreciate you uh, telling us about your products and the new volts. Thank you very much. Well, that wraps up the video of Reefstock Denver. I hope you've enjoyed it as much as I have. It was a really phenomenal show, had a lot of fun, talked to a lot of great people and heard a lot of wonderful stories about Jake Adams. And it, it was just a really good turnout for the show. And getting to see those legacy corals being fragged by Chris Meckley was pretty cool. So I can't wait till next year and hopefully I'll see some of you guys at the show next year as well. Now, if you have any questions about the products that I showed you in the video, feel free to leave a comment below and let me know. We'll try and get you some more information. Okay, this has been Hillary for Waterlogged on behalf of saltwateraquarium.com. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.